Hi everyone, welcome back to Takey Review. Today we're going to take a look at Down in Bermuda, which is a new release on Apple Arcade. Now if you're not sure what Apple Arcade is, that's Apple's new gaming subscription service. Now, Down in Bermuda is a puzzle adventure game, so if you're into your puzzle games or your kids are into your puzzle games, this one could be a winner. So let's jump in and have a look. Okay, let's have a quick look at settings, see what the controls are for this game. Okay, they look pretty simple. So let's jump in and start the game. Okay, our poor guys crashed on an island in the Bermuda Triangle. And here we get a look at our first puzzle. So the idea of the game is to help this guy solve the puzzles, get the clues, and hopefully eventually get off the island. Okay, so we can move these tiles around by sliding them up and down. And if you notice on the ground, we've got some patterns that should match up with some of the stones. So it's a case of just moving the stones over the right pattern. And then when we've got the stones in the right order, we can move on to the next part of the puzzle. Now it has to be noted that puzzles aren't my thing. Um, I'm not very good at them. But we'll see how we get on. Okay, so it's one finger just to drag around the screen. That gets you to see a bit more of the island. Okay. There we are just solving some of the basic puzzles. And then we use two fingers and then slide left and right to actually rotate around the island. So again, we're starting off with quite simple, very, very simple basic puzzles. Now, as you go looking around the island, you'll see these little, little stars we have to collect. So I've just collected one there. And as you start scrolling around the island, you'll notice them and the idea is you're going to pick those up because they're going to come in handy a little bit later on. So I've just picked up one there and inside the plane you can see another little star and they actually go to that board and when you've collected them all that whole board will then light up for you.
Okay, back to the puzzle in hand. Now to move those dials, it's simply just press and hold. After about a second, you can then slide your finger up and down to actually rotate the actual dial. So essentially, on each island, you've got a bunch of puzzles to solve, a few things to find. Ultimately, you're looking for these orbs, which will open up a portal, which will get you to your next island. So for this island, there are three portals. We've just been given one. There's the second, so the second one's going in place. We need to find one more, and then we can use that portal to get to our next island. To find the stars, you really do have to look everywhere. Once you've got all the stars, you can go back to the board, press the button and see it light up. Now you can press that at any time and it will tell you how many you're missing. So once we've got all the stars, this has given us our last orb. So we should be able to activate the portal, get to our next island and start the next round of puzzles. Okay, so here we are on our next island. There's a little bit more ground to cover on this one and probably lots more hiding places for these stars. And I would imagine the puzzles will start to get a little bit harder. Okay, so it looks like we've got another another person to help here. By solving some puzzles, I think they'll help us get some of these orbs that we need to move on. Now, I don't want to play too much more of this game and give too much away, but this is a good, fun puzzle game, adventure game. It's great for the kids, graphics are really nice, really smooth, and 
as the game goes on, the puzzles get harder and harder. I hope you've liked this video. Please remember to like and subscribe. I'm going to be reviewing lots more games that are in the new Apple Arcade, so please remember to hit that bell so you get notified of any new videos I upload. I'd love to hear what you think about this game, how you're getting on, so please leave some comments below. Thanks very much for watching, and I will see you all next time.